Hi, my name is John Almendra, and I'm here to surprise my great friend uh, Mark Quinones on his birthday. It wasn't really a surprise. It's an honor to be here and wish you a happy birthday, my brother, my familia, on this uh, great day, your birthday. I wish you many, many, many more. Que siga gozando, siga bailando, siga guarachando, showing everybody all over the world all your talents, all your goodness. No, tú no, no, eso no. No te meta. <laughs> anyway, my best to you on your birthday. Happy birthday. Que cumpla mucho más, mi hermanito. Y que siga allá con la, con la marcha de los jíbaros. Bye. How old is Mark? Nice. Mark, how old is Mark now? How old is Mark? Mark is 36. Mark, you're getting old, bro. I'm only 32, so you got... So, Mark, happy birthday, bro. Hey, where's the camera? Where's it, where'd it go? Oh, yes. <laughs> no. Happy birthday, Mark. Charge me less money. All right. You're too expensive. What's the Martin Cohen prices, bro? Uh, Sergio, Mark has a new car. He needs more money. Brand new Mercedes Benz Black Is parked outside. Yes, oh, he does. So the rates are going Wait up. Wait a minute. Where are you getting money from to buy Mercedes Benz and all this stuff, man? I know. I I want to I want to cut out of that. I want three drives out of that car. <laughs> oh, now we are. Now we are. I just want to say happy birthday to Michael. Buy my other my better half, and um, just hoping and wishing you many, many, many more. And I hope I can be here every year to celebrate it with you, man. Love you much, and uh, continue the great work. It's it's amazing. I still say it's amazing. Such a little person with a with a big attitude. And so much talent in the system, but gotta love you, bro. Gotta love you. Enjoy, man. Ron, Mark, I just want to say happy birthday. God bless you. May you have many more. And I hope you let me drive your Benz. <laughs> Hello, my dear viewers. This is uh, Jose Jaime from Actualidad y Más. And we want to wish uh, Mark Quinon is one of the best percussionists around. Uh, many, many more uh, happy birthdays. So, you know, he's a good guy. He's a musician. <laughs> Here we are. Mark's birthday bash. No Mark for about, uh, what, 15 years, fellas? I guess you guys don't care, right? Anyway, uh, I'm just glad to be a part of this, and I hope that Mark has a wonderful incoming year. And uh, what, what else can I say? He, he's been a very important part of my life. Uh, goes beyond music, and uh, I hope that we can spend a lot more years growing and sharing the good things in life. Happy birthday, Mark. Bueno, uh, aquí celebrando la fiesta de su uh, 36 años de vida, el señor Mark Quiñones. Marky, happy birthday. Martin, happy birthday to you too. Just in case I miss yours. Oh no, I, I won't miss that one. Uh, so we're just here celebrating, you know, Mark's 36th birthday with, uh, with all the all the fellas here, Sergio, Tony, Vinny. Hey, Tony, come up for air, bro. <laughs> Be like, <laughs> all right, and uh, Marky, let's uh, we gotta have to keep the doing, uh, keep on making some good music in the next 36 years. Yeah, you're excused. All right. So, uh, Mark, again, happy birthday, and, uh, you know, best wishes for uh, at least 36 more. Peace. Mark, happy birthday. All the best. You're definitely the Millennium Man. That's definitely it. Um, oh, yeah. Is he? Notice that, right? Anyway, um, I wish you all the best. All the best. You're definitely beyond... This century, so uh, you fit. You gotta fit right in, right in the next century. So uh, all the best, happy birthday, and uh, enjoy yourself, enjoy life. Uh, what can I say about Mark? He's a good guy. He's got a lot of money because he just bought a new Mercedes. So he's gotta have a lot of money. Uh, I know I'm already for ten years. Um, so I hope you can lend me some money next year for Christmas. You know, God bless him, man. Uh, Mark Quinones, you know, you're one of my inspirations. Puerto Rican from the Bronx, 
Uh, South Bronx with a black, brand new Mercedes Benz parked out front. I mean, you've come a long way, bro, and you well deserve it. And I admire your courage for taking on a mortgage by the waterfront, swimming with the rats. And uh, I wish you the best of luck. You are well deserving of all your success, and I cherish you as a friend. Yo, where is this shit coming from, man? What? <laughs> this this hair. It's your sweater. Oh man. We're here at uh, Joe's Pub, Joe's Cafe in the Bronx, and uh, oh, Joe's place. Excuse me, I don't even know where I'm at. But I just want to say that I really appreciate Bobby Allende going all out here, inviting all these, you know, friends, family members to come and celebrate my 36th birthday. But don't tell anybody I'm 36, please. Because I'm not Tony Cintron. I don't need to yell into the mic, man. I know how to use this thing. Anyway, sorry for the interruption. But, uh... Anyways, uh, I just want to say thanks to everybody for, you know, coming out and helping me celebrate this. Uh, it's not really momentous occasion because, uh, you know, but anyway, thank you. Yo, I didn't come here to rehearse, man. I'm not rehearsing. I'm hungry. I don't want to rehearse. You either get this take or it's over. Thank you. Should I take the candy out of my mouth? Okay. Put the stomach in. Put the stomach in. Take the candy out. What else? Any more instruction? Come on, Sarek. Tell me. You want me to take the guayabera off? Oh. Eddie Fania All Star Montalvo over there. Okay. As I was saying previously. Uh, I met Mark Quinones one evening, I think it was a Wednesday night, at the Corso nightclub. What year? Um, what year? Good question. <laughs> I have no idea what year, but uh, for about nine months people were talking about this young timbalero who was taking everybody's work, including mine. So, so, all of a sudden, there was a slump on calls for recordings. People weren't calling. I'm saying, damn, why aren't anybody calling? And it was because they were calling this guy. Everybody was calling this guy to do these recordings. Finally, I met him at the Corso. And um, he seemed to be kind of short. No, I mean, seemed to be a nice guy. Uh, we hit it off right away. We spoke a little bit. He was kind of on the shy side. Uh, and for some reason or other, we've sort of always spoke about the mutual admiration and respect that we have for each other. I'm here today uh, because I'm hungry and I want to eat. No. <laughs> because, um, you know... I think, first of all, I'm glad they invited me to this occasion, and um, I wouldn't have missed it for anything in the world. I, you know, again, I have a lot of respect for Mark. Um, pardon? I have to pay? Okay, so I got to be leaving now, but <laughs> I have no idea how old he is. I don't know how old he was when I met him. All I know that for the last 15 years, in one way or another, Mark's been in my life, and you know I always look forward to listening to what he's doing. Um, uh, I think he's great. You know, he's one of the contemporary guys out there that that I respect, and you know, uh, I'm just here, you know, to, to celebrate on his birthday. How old is Mark? 36. 36. Wow. He's 36. I never knew you were only two years older. I mean, uh, younger than I was. But anyway, um, we're all here, as you can see. There's a lot of great people here for Mark. And uh, all I can say is, you know, I look forward to keep on learning things every time I hear him. He taught me the six, the, the abanico, 
which I use all the time, the six stroke of an equal. I haven't been able to teach him anything, but you know, I'm gonna keep practicing and one day I'm gonna be able to call him and say, Mark, I got something to uh, to show you. So in the meantime, I'll keep practicing and uh, I'm just happy to be here. Thank you. I like it like that, no. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs>